that's actually dew, not rain. So it's a good start. There will be exciting things that I do on my Beano, either on YouTube or on the blog where I post a YouTube video. Anyway, getting completely off the subject, it's the 24th of August 2017, 04 10 hours, British summer time. And I'm off on another Beano, the end of summer Beano, the end of the summer of sharks Beano. Be discovery. Hereford again, and I'm looking forward to it. Your basic arrival from the dark and into the light. Time 6.16. Cost of coffee open at half six. This is where I'll be staying tonight. And I'm thinking bacon roll, jumping around on my subjects. That's cool, but it's pleasant, as befits the end of the summer of sharks. Look here. So, um, there, and then there, and up there. Um, shouldn't start sentences with them, but there's no real cascade on. And this vagabond is a bit lively. 4.5% alcohol by volume from Brewdog. Gluten free. Lovely hoppy aroma. Not sure about that. I'll come back. So I'm still not sure, and it looks like it's bottle conditioned, although I don't think it is. Sharp, bitter, and malty, and huge head, which has now subsided. And give it a B plus in a bit. Yeah. Okay, so half owned by Heineken from Petaluma. I'm listening to this week in Google, also from Petaluma. Alright, can't remember. Mm, um, 6.2% alcohol by volume. Apparently they don't sell many of them. Probably why they haven't got many guest bales or neither. This is aged. And what the output is on it. Anyway, B plus in a bit. Nice and hoppy, but yeah. So the issue was that bacon bath I had earlier. I lowered my appetite, so no curry Thursday for me. And straight here, it's not slightly open, despite the fact that I'm three minutes early. Right, Jim. Um, yeah. Tap takeover. <coughs> so, the first one is from Siren, because they're doing a tap takeover. C-A-P-H-E-I-N-E. -E. Caffeine. A salad with coffee and raspberries. 6.2%. Yikes. Mm. Anyway, nice flowers. I like the flowers. Ooh. Getting the salad, getting the raspberries. Raspberries in the finish. Not getting much coffee. 
Oh, no, I don't know. <laughs> oh, whatever. Anyway, um, B plus plus. And in other news, hops equals goldings. I know that's going to upset someone. I know. This is a cucumber pale ale. <laughs> that's called white from Thornbridge, and it's completely and utterly different. And you get the cucumber only in the finish and it's refreshing 4.7% alcohol by volume still lovely flowers um, B++ look at the size of that B in that oh. golden so only available in thirds due to the 9.9% .9 blow your head off <laughs> ABB also from the top takeover, this is his Turkish Imperial Stout with coffee and figs. I'm thinking barista. Well, maybe that sounds like that. Oh, oh wow. Uh, really strong aroma. Look, I don't I'm going to give it B plus in a bit because it. I've never been to the other honey. <laughs> a little bit too alcoholic for me. Yeah. But the coffee really comes through in the finish. They yeah. say, oh, this is what we. Lambic. Timmermans. Blanche Lambicus. Mm -hmm. Corkage. 4.5% alcohol by volume. You get that. Um, yeah, funky aroma. Hmm. Nicely sour. Touch funky. Oh, I like that. A little bit sharp in the finish. Yep. It is you, Louis. Yes. I'm going to give that a B plus plus. Apparently, mangoes and jalapeno. Or something like that. I'm not sure. But it's 7% alcohol by volume from Fighting Dog. It smells fruity. Ooh. Getting the peppers coming through in the finish. And uh, feel on time. It's like semi curry. Must be plus plus. Yeah, really getting the peppers. 